G'day guys, I just wanted to do a quick video on my 12 volt setup. I'm only running a fridge and some LED awning lights at this stage, so don't I don't need anything too elaborate. I use the Kickass DC DC charger and wiring kit, which has the normal positive and negative wires as well as an ignition wire for cars with smart alternators. So in simple terms, it will only charge while your car is running and won't drain your start battery. I'm also adding Kickass's mini power box, which has more than enough outputs for my needs. I wanted to be able to remove the second battery and fridge when necessary, so so I opted for a false floor for the Ute tub. I made this from 12 mil marine ply. I covered the false floor in marine grade carpet. I made side panels the same way and and mounted them using the tie down points and angle brackets to the floor. This also helps to keep the floor in place. Wiring up the charger was very simple, just three wires, one of each to the positive and negative battery terminal and the blue wire to ignition source. I used a double fuse adapter for this. I bought some conduit from BCF and ran the cable down the back of the engine bay and along the left hand chassis rail following existing wiring back to the tub. There is a gap between the inner and outer skin of the tub front panel at the top on either side. I fed some packing strap down from the top and pulled the cable up into the tub. The charger has three Anison plugs. A standard Anison to connect to the second battery, the three pin Anison to connect to the cables from the start battery and a solar input. It also has a thin black sensor wire that goes to the negative terminal on your second battery. As you can see here I'm, I mounted the charger and mini power box to the side panel and connected another Anison plug to the solar input. I ran this through the same hole in the tub and back up on the outside to connect to a solar panel. I screwed on brackets to a King's 160 watt solar panel and mounted them to the removable Rhino crossbars on the tub as I get the afternoon sun where the ute is parked. This will hopefully keep the battery charged up. Alright, thanks for watching and let me know if you have any questions and remember take your rubbish with you and leave only tracks.